welcome to my vlog so i've been kind of on the edge of whether i want to vlog or not because i usually don't vlog like that i did vlog this last year and i definitely want to do it again this year but you know i'm trying to slowly get into the swing of things again because vlogging is a lot i like to just do my day-to-day -day activities and not be bothered but I'm gonna try so I actually probably ran all my errands that I had to do I had to go get gas take my anklet to get fixed um I had to go get my flu shot so I got my flu shot at Publix and it was free and they give you a $10 gift card um but it was a guy like in the store and he was like Chelsea no he said Chanel Chanel so you know chanel is not my name so i didn't answer so he keeps running up behind me mind you he was tall he was a big dude so i'm like my name is not michelle uh chanel and he was like but could i ask you something i was like no and then he was like stupid i'm like what people is crazy y'all you gotta watch your back because people are literally crazy so after that i went to halloween spirits um and i'm gonna show you guys what i got real quick i got these caveman arm warmers but i feel like this looks like leopard type attire like leopard halloween costume so i just got it it was on sale for 3.97 so either i'm gonna be a leopard cheetah girl or not a cheetah girl but like a cheetah or a leopard you guys know like a cat and i got this um inflatable bone because i may also be um the the what's that thing called y'all with like the bone um thelma or i don't know what it's called but i'll put a picture here so I'm gonna either be her or like a leopard so i'm going into party city now see what i can find because i have a halloween party to go to so let's go stuff that they have guys i don't really see anything that i like at all um and i didn't want like a mask that like covers my face i just wanted like some furry ears with the leopard print but i can't really find that in here um and then of course they have like bunny stuff so let's keep looking So guys, I just left Party City. I didn't find anything. Like I am so picky. Um, I've seen some stuff that like I could finesse, but I don't want to finesse anything. I feel like I'm gonna have to. But um I wanna look some more until until like I just have to pick something. So I was gonna go to the mall but I'm hungry so I'm on my way home so your girl can eat because she's hungry 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 I'm about to eat lunch and this is I'm eating some pollo tropical but as you guys can see I got Proyo Tropical yesterday and I usually get the Choppy Chop Bowl. I get white rice with corn, um, black beans, and grilled chicken. And believe it or not, this is actually half. Um, so I eat half one day and half the next day, but I just kind of moved it around in the bowl so I can heat up in the microwave. But y'all, you know how you go to a place and you don't want that unless they have the sauce 
and I'm not even a sauce person, guys. I'm not a sauce person. So I got this, I got this yesterday and they only had two small sauces. So that was enough for me to eat half, but I needed more for my other half. So I went back today and I just was like, do y'all have the um, cilantro garlic sauce? And she was like, yeah, you want the small cups or the big cup? I'm like, give me the big cup. Cause I'm not even finna play with y'all. So I paid like $2.75 for this. As you guys can see, here it is. But if they don't have this sauce, I don't want this choppy chop bowl, basically. Oh, I thought that was somebody for a package. But yeah, guys, if they don't have this sauce, then I just don't want I don't want the choppy chop bowl. So I am literally addicted to this sauce um i was getting these choppy chop bowls a lot but i've since calmed down and i only get it sometimes when i'm like craving it but guys it you gotta try it it's so good if you've had it before let me know how you like it um but i cannot get this choppy chop bowl without my sauce and I would say my other addiction, food addiction, is Mr. and Mrs. Crab, and then the red velvet, um, the red velvet cheesecake at Cheesecake Factory. Boo! They get all my money. So, mm. this sauce is so good, guys. So now I have some to go in my refrigerator. looking through my clothes that's in my trunk because your girl has clothes everywhere because you know kind of homeless right now <laughs> technically um so i'm just looking for some stuff and i also need to like transition into my winter clothes because um it's getting cold in Florida it's not cold but it's definitely cold in Atlanta so I need to like get some of my um, get some of my winter clothes out and I'm also like looking for something that could potentially be for Halloween for my Halloween costume so um, that's what we're doing. I don't think I'm going to take all these clothes out because it's too many clothes back here. I didn't think it would be so much. I'm probably also going to go to my brother's dad's house to look for some more of my clothes because, you know, everything is everywhere and I don't really... I can't like physically see all my clothes because they're not in my house. So yeah, that's what we're doing today. And y'all, I still don't know where I'm gonna be for Halloween. Hopefully I figure it out because time is ticking.
guys i know this vlog has kind of been like all over the place but uh the last time you guys saw me talking it was when i was getting my clothes out my trunk so i just was doing stuff um like replying to customer emails and stuff like that and packing and i'm going to my brother's dad's house right now to go get like some of the rest of my clothes um because i know it's going to be cold at nighttime and i just want to i think my coat is over his house if not it's in storage so i'll go there when i get to where i'm going but um i just wanted to get my eyebrows done i think they look really good what do you guys think comment down below my eyebrows look really good and she did it so fast so fast so um my face is like greasy and then when i take off the mask like my mouth area be all wet i guess from my hot breath and i'm like breaking out right there guys so hopefully that goes away before all the festivities but yes guys i love my eyebrows and i just wanted to get them done i don't usually get them done but i just wanted to get them done because i know i'm be out and about and i want to look presentable if i don't have on any makeup i feel like it kind of gives you a facelift oh yes guys i went to get like my free um lotion you guys know how you get the coupons in the mail and you get a free lotion so I went to go get it and I'm like, I'm getting my free lotion. Look how small it is now. I ended up getting the Into the Night Shea Butter Hand Cream. And look how small it is now, guys. Like, it never used to be this small. It was like a bigger bottle than this. But I guess they said, if we giving away free stuff, it's going to be smaller. So, I like to get those hand creams because I put them, like, in this part in my car or in my purse. Um, I got these from the dollar store, these Nivea's lotions. So, and see, for example, the bottles used to be this big. Now, this is two fluent ounces, 59 ml. So, let's see how much this is. One fluid ounce. So, they literally went down half a size crazy they used to be this size or even a little bit bigger i tell you so yeah guys i'm gonna go get the rest of my clothes and i'll talk to you guys when i get there okay guys so the the lighting is so bad in here i don't even think it's the light in here but yeah i have that hamper that suitcase then this suitcase so um i just got this little velour suit that i have because of course it's getting cold. Oh, shoot. So, I didn't find my jackets, and hopefully, it's in this one, guys. But yes, the furs, honey, the furs, the furs. So, funny story about this suitcase, guys. Hopefully, you can see like those scratches and stuff on there. So I was in the airport. This was last December when I went um, to Chicago on my brand trip. I'll leave that vlog up in the cards. But I was <laughs> going down the escalator and I had this big, huge suitcase. I had another suitcase and another bag. And I had filled them to capacity and I just had too much stuff. And, um, I was going down the escalator and I put one of my bags on the escalator, but you guys know how the escalator keeps going and I just felt myself tipping over. So I was like, it's either me or this suitcase. And honey, I let the suitcase go and it went sliding down the freaking, um, it went sliding down the escalator and it almost hit this man which i think it kind of did hit him and i was so embarrassed but you know i had skinned up my new suitcase because i had got these suitcases when i actually went there i just was like oh my goodness so i don't even see my jacket in here so 
We'll probably have to go to the storage tomorrow to go pick that up. Hey guys, so I finally made it to Atlanta. I went to my storage and got some stuff. Um, but I was gonna film for you guys, but my mom called, well, I called her to let her know I was here and then she started talking about other stuff. So I'll probably go back one of these days and I'll show you guys if you wanna see. Um, so yeah, I had to go to my storage to get like my little trench coat type thing. It's not cold here at all, but I know at night um, the temperature drops. So I just wanna have something cause I don't have anything. And that jacket is like cute. Thanks for being an early voter. Y'all, I'm so sick of these people freaking texting me about voting. I voted early, I voted by mail. Like, I don't wanna hear it anymore. Don't text me anymore. And in the plethora of group chats that I'm in, one girl was like, if I vote, will they stop texting me? Like, no sis, they're not. Sorry. So yeah, I'm about to pull up to my friend's house and um, my other friend, it's her birthday today. So she's having a birthday dinner. So we're all going to that. So I will see you guys when we're on the way to her dinner. Okay, y'all, so I'm actually sitting here editing and I did not get to close the vlog off last night. We had a blast. We had so much fun. And um, the girls that came and were dancing with us at the table, we didn't even know them. They were just so sweet and they were also celebrating one of their friend's birthdays. So, you know, it was just all one big collective thing. So. I'm closing out this vlog guys um i hope you all enjoyed and the next vlog next friday will be on the halloween party so you'll get to see what i actually chose for my halloween costume and you'll see the actual halloween party so i'll see you guys then bye